Hey guys, it's Chastity with Life with the Monacos, and I've already been on the trail for a while, but I figured I would take you for a hike today. Um, we are somewhere along the Quahanna Trail. Uh, we're doing the small loop, and I will insert a map right here. So, if you want to hike around for a little bit, follow me. Um, I didn't tell you guys. One of the first things, I'm taking a break right now. Uh, one of the first things I am going to replace in my hiking is my sunglasses. It is a gorgeous fall day and I've been trying to get out into nature a lot more because I need to, I need to. I haven't exactly grasped the concept of trekking poles and um, poles. I don't know if you guys, I know the sun is right in your eyes, but I haven't like got the whole vlogging. I don't know where to stick them. I don't, and I was enjoying it too much, but I figured, I always say that I am going to take you guys on a hike and I never do. So I'm doing it now. But like I said, the first thing I'm gonna replace is these sunglasses. Uh, I do know Oakley's have a prescription sunglass where Jeremy has a pair and they're awesome. They are awesome and they don't slide off your nose. So mine are constantly going like this. I look like, I don't even know what I look like. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys around. All right. This is where I'm at. I'm in a little clearing, so I had good sunlight. That's where I came from. It's, I mean, you can see the trail, but it is barely there. And we're about to go into the darkness. I do have my Solomon Trail Runners on. My darn tough socks. Uh, and I'll try to figure out how to hike with you guys. All right, I think the first thing I need to do, it is gorgeous, is figure out where to put my trekking poles. All right guys, this pool, I just crossed this road and that means I have gone too far. So I know there is a water source down here and it is gorgeous so I will show you um and you can see the path is barely there it is wet my shoes are kind of soaked but look at this everything's just starting to change um it's not bad it's a little dark, but it is so nice out here. Uh, and again, wait till you see, like down here a little bit, it's gorgeous. Now we are following the orange blazes. And a lot of people ask me, like when I hike, and I am alone, but like, how do I not get lost? This right here, see that orange blaze? That's how you don't get lost. Ooh, it's getting dark down in here. It's been dark a lot. Um, it's, it's just nice. It's beautiful. Um, lots of roots on this trail. But it is so pretty down here, you guys. Uh, I am not carrying today and this trail isn't as worn you guys can see like this is what you're walking over this thing right there be careful and I have pine needles all in my hair because it's just the way it is. Uh, here's the water source. And 
there's a little bridge. But do you see all the orange blazes? I'll show some more to you. <laughs> like, I mean, of course you're going to want to go over the bridge. But that one, whoa, sunlight. Let's try that right there. Okay, that's how you don't get lost. Two blazes means, what is it? You're turning, you're going straight. That one, you're going straight. Do you see that one up there? We'll go up to it. We can see where the trail is. This is so cute. I'll turn you around so you can see my glasses falling off my nose. Ah, uh, okay. So I just pushed them back on my nose and I wasn't recording, it happens. But I should have brought my regular like prescription glasses because it is very dark on the trail. Uh, there's been a couple of places that I've been like, ooh, that's a little rough. All right, I'm gonna continue hiking. I will see you in a little bit. Okay, you guys all know how much I love to go uphill. And I'm still, I don't know what to do with my trike poles. How do you Appalachian Trail people do it? Like this is the first time I've really vlogged and hiked. I don't know. Like what do I do with my trekking poles? Someone help me out. Okay, so we'll just go. Wait till you guys see this. Like, this is, there goes the glasses again. See, put them up there. All right, let me turn you around. All right, guys, I figured it out. Um, I'm still going up a little bit of a hill, but no biggie. Um, we are still on the trail, and I'm going to continue on this trail. But I'm going to close out this video. But I want you to see what I've done with my trekking. Pool. and this is just right now okay I must be coming up on another road did you see where my trekking pool is Ooh, right here I just shoved it there and it seems to be working um I'm getting the hang of this ah uh, the glasses are as annoying as heck but we are going to continue on this hike and if you want to see more videos like this or where I'm going or what I'm doing sorry guys that was a root um let me know and I will video more hikes but for now this is me signing out happy I figured out what to do with my trekking pool I didn't sign out um trekking pool is still here I made it back to the main road well, as main road as you can get, but it was awesome. And here's the deal. Everyone knows I don't like to exercise. In fact, someone asked me to go to the gym and I'm like, no. Did you say drink on the porch? But my glasses, anyone who has or prescription glasses that can tell me what kind of glasses to get that will make hiking more enjoyable for me and protect my eyes from the UV. Let me know. Um, I am trying to get back to the Jeep. It was a great time. And here's the deal. Back to what I was saying about the gym. You're getting a little bit of cardio, right? That's great. But when you hike, it's more like endurance um it's i don't like this day pack because i can't reach my water very good but it's more of an endurance than anything so your cardio is going up but it's staying it's it's great uh so anyone looking to get out and about 
try hiking. All right, I'm back at the Jeep. Um, I might make something to eat because I've been out there for a long time and didn't take enough. So, um, I will see you guys in my next video. Enjoy.